Good morning everyone, it's Monday the 1st of April and I thought I'd do a weekly vlog so with the whole week went to Sunday because Sunday's got some car boots so I want to do that did try a weekly vlog before and I thought god it's just going to be so boring for everybody but I thought I'd do one again sort of see what it was like so as I say oh, I got a new phone so I'm trying out the camera as well if you excuse the mess it's only it's gone 6am and I'm up having my breakfast before I go to get Jennifer up and go to work um Oh, you make it. But yeah, so I was sitting here having my breakfast and watching Lonnie over at Garage Flips, which is my favourite thing to do first thing in the morning. So I'm going to have my breakfast and I'll see you later. So we've made it to nursery. Jennifer's crying. She doesn't like being in the car very much. So I'm just going to go and get her out and then we're going to head over and get this work day done. And then we'll see what's happening next. I've got some orders to pull, which I'll show you later, which I'll be posting tomorrow. Not tomorrow off, so I'll be dropping... Jennifer in tomorrow morning and then doing some eBay work. Yay! Excited, isn't it? Hi! Say hi, Jennifer. So, work's over and I've picked Jennifer up and we're at Nana and Grandad's now. So, yep, we're going to go in and say hello. She is. So, as you can see, she's lost her socks. Lost them in nursery, didn't you? Well, one of them. So, we're going to find them tomorrow, aren't they? Yes, they are. Should we go and see Grandad? Yes, we will. So Jennifer's just had her tea and she's going to clean her light chair now, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. So I'm just going to show you um, something that I sold over the weekend. Um, you have to excuse the mess because I've just been feeding Jennifer there, so I've got food everywhere. This is a Donkey Kong handheld video game donkey kong hockey it's, it does work and it was paul's from when he was a kid it's uh, from 1984 and we listed it on saturday and it sold straight away for 150 pounds so really pleased with that um so i've got to package that up that'll be going out tomorrow morning well, everyone it is tuesday april the 2nd and uh, the last thing i was telling you sorry it's a bit dark showing you was what i sold on the weekend um, I've just dropped Jennifer off at nursery and uh, I've taken the day off to do some work on the eBay mess. So I'm just going to turn the camera around and show you. This is what I'm dealing with. So as you can see, those boxes of clothes all stacked and sorted and numbered. And then I've got one, two, three bags there. Four bags there of clothes that have been listed but not away in fact it's four and a bit there's one two three four five bags of unlisted macy's wearing a nice phase eight dress there's two returns to go back in the box but it's right at the bottom so i'll do it when i'm refilling these and i've got a box downstairs that i'm working on so i'm going to work on that one got some empty boxes here that one's got clothes in it it is it's stuff that needs to be <coughs> organized that's my plan for today. Some board games. Balls. He doesn't want any more Super Cup football. Apparently it goes for about £65. So got this one here which I've pulled out. This is uh, something I've got to post out today. It's a LK Bennett black wrap over dress and it cost me a pound uh, for 25 So happy with that. So I'm going to go on downstairs now with that and get that packaged up with the other items that I've got to post out today. So there's the Donkey Kong Hockey. I'm going to pop that in a nice big Amazon box. A new mobile phone came in. And I also sold this rather sparkly next top which cost me around 50p. It went for 10 quid. So that's all right, plus postage. Happy with that, so it only cost me 50 pounds because there's wet wipes up there because baby wipes having a baby, there's they're always around. So I'm gonna get this packaged up and then I'm gonna start organising the next lot of stuff. It's gonna take a while. It's just gone 12 o'clock and I have finished for now. That box is half done. There's two items in there I didn't get a chance to do, but I wanted the bag they were in. I've still got a few bags upstairs that I need to um, to pack into. 
But I'll have to leave it for now because I've got to go to the post office. I've got to go and get some something for my mum. She wants some potatoes. And then I've got to pick up Jennifer from the nursery. So if I'm lucky, Jennifer will let me do a bit of work this afternoon. And I can finish those two off and do a bit more. But if I'm not, I'll be stuck. I don't use the mess on the sofa. It's all wet wipes. Baby wipes are everywhere. So, yes, I've got my three items packaged up, ready to go. I'm going to put them in, an, in a bag, take them to the post office. And, yes, I'm going to do a bit of sourcing as well. I'm going to have a look at my favourite sourcing spots, if there's anything worth picking up there today. But I'll let you know that later. So, I've been to the post office, and that was a flipping nightmare because the normal girls weren't there, so they had to temp in. And he was on his own, so I had to wait, because even though I got drop and go, he said, if I didn't wait, it probably wouldn't get sent today, because he's got loads of them to do, and he's been really busy. I had to get potatoes, highly exciting. I've also got some Cadbury's buttons. Pick up four tops, nothing exciting. Um, one that hasn't got any brand on it, but it was just a really nice, sort of jumpery thing. A next, no, a next skirt, uh, two skirts, two tops, a next skirt and a max weekend top, which is really nice. Um, but that's it, I was just in there paying and I chinged. So I just had, a, had an offer for a dress, which is one of my own, so I'm happy to take it. So, it's fine. So yeah, I'm going to go and pick up Jennifer now, it's just started raining. It's hard work, this life, isn't it? So, um, I'll see you back at the old homestead a bit later. Morning everybody on YouTube world. Uh, it's Wednesday, April the 3rd. So you can hear I've still got a croaky voice. My throat doesn't feel like shards of glass now. Thank you, TCP. Best thing in the world for gargling with, although I'm really thirsty. Just about to drop Jennifer into nursery and have a kind of a plan. Well, two plans this afternoon. So if she's asleep, I can get on with boxing up the clothing. If she's not, then not a lot's going to get done because she'll want me to hold her so she can sleep. But what will happen then in the evening is I've got some items I can list that aren't clothing. Um, some computer games, a camera, um, some LG glasses for gaming. I have no idea. Um, so I've got a few things that can be listed. Um, so I'll probably list those. I've also got some stuff that I sold, well, I put on auction, but it didn't sell at auction. Um, and I started them like it's just some clothing that I started at two ninety nine or three ninety nine. I thought, well, I'll put it on buy it now at that, and see how it goes. And if it still doesn't sell at that low price on buy it now, I'll probably bag it up and take it down to uh, one of those cash for clothes sites and see what I can get. Um, yeah, so I'm going to go and take Jennifer into nursery now and uh, do my normal day job, and um, I will see you a bit later when I'm at home. I'll let you know what's going on then. So planning has gone out the window. She's asleep on me. She slept for a little while and then she woke up crying. So picked her up, changed her. She went back to sleep on me and then she woke up screaming. I don't think she's very well. She's got a bit of a bad cough, as you can hear. So I'm sort of stuck till Paul gets home. We've had tea and then I'll, I'll do what listing I can. Um, is what it is. She's got to come first. Always. So that's going to be it for me for Wednesday. So, yeah, there's not a lot happening at the moment. Not good. So I'm going to catch up on my... Oh, my YouTube while she sleeps. Poor little thing. And I'll uh, see what happens tomorrow. <laughs> so it's Thursday now, the 4th of April. My voice is getting worse. It's very sore throat. Yesterday was a total write-off. I um, don't know what today's going to be like. I did have a sale yesterday, which is great. So that's in the boot to be posted later, because I might as well. Yeah, I have two-day handling. If an order comes in before a certain time, I'll, I'll just ship it the next day. As you can see, it's horrendous out there. Absolutely horrible. I haven't done anything on eBay for over a week. Gotta crack on with it. Tons of stuff to list. So like I said, I did have a sale yesterday, which was a coat. I sold it for £17. I had it on for £22.99, but it's been hanging around for a while. And it's a nice coat, but I just thought I'd just get it out of the way. It only cost me a quid, so it was a nice little profit in it. So I'm happy with that. Just killing time now to take Jennifer and Nursery a bit earlier today, because she left earlier, because... Uh, 
usually when it's like this the traffic's horrendous but no it wasn't so we'll go in in a bit she uh she wasn't good last night she was sick in bed that's how to change the bed in change her change me because i got it all over me and then she was sick in my bed so i had to change my bed in poor kid after that though it was only a little bit of sick after that but uh, she slept all night, she was all right then. I'm hoping she's okay. She's still coughing a bit, but she's not too bad. So the plan for today is to go and hopefully work for four and a half hours, if my throat will let me. Because obviously I work on the phones. Not good. Then I'm gonna to go to the post office and post those two items. Go to my usual sale. See if there's any good stock. And then I'm going to um, get some chips and go to my mum's. I've got to be back for three because I've got the washing machine repair man come in. Which is good because I need my washing machine repaired because it's not working. Well, it is working. It's making a hell of a row. <coughs> so that's it. I'll see you later. Oh, my throat's so sore. I hope you have a better day than I've had the last couple of days. I hope your sales are really good. And I'll see you soon. Right, I finished work. Spent the day off the phones because my throat was so bad I couldn't speak. So I was doing the admin, which is fine, quite like doing that. And now, I can't not do that, I need to do it that way. Um, going to get Jennifer out of the car and take my two packages to the post office. I would be in left hand because I want to hold my hand with my, my phone with my left hand, but that means my hand will be on the camera. So we have two packages. I don't know if you can see them there, I'll show you in a minute. Here we are, two big items. One's the bottom one's a coat that I was talking about earlier. And the top one's a dress of mine that's been around for a while. Just been trying to get rid of stuff like that. Um, yeah, no hands. I'm going to get Jennifer out. There she is. She's having a sleep, so I'll be back in a minute. Okay, so it's Thursday evening. And I'm going to photograph these glasses. This computer game, which was Christopher's, and this Kodak um, brownie camera. I've got one of these that I've in a box, so I'm keeping. Um, it's got a roll of film in it as well, which I'm using. So these are a pound. In the charity shop. That's obviously free. Uh, I think this came in a bag of cameras that was about a pound, I expect. So I'm just going to get on and photograph these three so I can get them added to my eBay account and listed. I've got so much to do as you can see. Like, oh dear, look at all that. Um, it's just having time and obviously I'm not very well at the moment with my throat. So yeah, it's not good. I need to, to get it sorted. So I'm going to crack on with that. So I also so I photographed those now. I've also sold top. I think it's at the bottom. I think it's number one. Yep, there it is. Oops, it's come undone. This is a manta ray top. Sold only for £8.50. Plus shipping. So, I think you just keep turning it over, you know? So I think I won't be posting that till Saturday. Get it out now. It's done. As you can see, I still haven't put those two jumpers away. These back in here. Just one more item to go back in. Pop the lid back on. This one back on top. Oh, you can see his boxes. So, yeah. so happy with that. At least it's a sale. Um, <coughs> that's probably going to be it for tonight. I don't know what I'm going to be doing tomorrow. I don't, know, I don't know if I'm going to work. I might be going to the doctor's. So I'm going to have to see how I feel. I feel quite rough at the moment. So I'm going to get those three items listed and take that down ready to be uh, packaged up. Yeah. There's my crap.
Crime books. My Jack the Ripper, followed by my Peter James. Yes, anyway, I'll see you all tomorrow. Uh, hopefully we get a bit more interesting soon. Good morning, everyone. It is Friday, April the 5th. That's the last day of the tax year. How exciting. Hopefully you've made good profits. Or... But hopefully you don't have a lot of tax to pay. Double edged swords. I know you can earn a certain amount before you have to pay it. So great. Let's hope everybody's had a good financial year. I am actually in profit in the first six months, only by about four hundred quid. But that's still good considering I'm not doing very much work on it and I'm just pottering around. So I've nearly finished my account. I've got a few more deductions to put on there from items bought. But even with all that on, it'll still be just over £400. So I'm happy with that, you know. So we'll get the tax return submitted and see what they say. I mean, I'm obviously I don't pay tax on my current job, my, my day job, because I only work part-time. So it's all great. So let's see what uh, Friday brings. Obviously, I'm going to do this throughout the entire week. So this will be uploaded on Sunday. <laughs> Um, I don't know if the boot sale will be on. It depends on whether I'll check the weather report later. My arm's killing me. So I'm going to go now, um, do my day job, and then we'll see what we can do this afternoon. I probably will have to pick washing up from my mum's because my washing machine's still on the blink. And I've just dropped a load of Jennifer's washing to mum's because it needs doing. Um, hopefully he'll come this afternoon and sort it out. And then uh, I can uh, do some more washing. Oh, exciting. <laughs> So I'll see you all after work. Bye. Hi everyone. It's Saturday and it's about 20 to 2. Um, I've been down the road, had my hair done. I had it cut and coloured and he's curled it with straighteners. I was going to take it with me but I actually forgot my phone. Which is just about typical for me on Saturday. Posted the one item I sold the other day today so that's gone off which is good. This afternoon I'm going to be sitting in front of the computer sorting out my shop categories and putting them, everything into them so you know ladies clothes sizes things and then um, film cameras photography equipment books computer games or video games such and such those sorts of things and do that for those that are interested currently reading the five by Hallie Rubin Rubenhold the untold lives of the women killed by Jack the Ripper so this is the canonical five Polly Nichols, Annie Chapman Elizabeth Stride Catherine Eddowes and Mary Jane Kelly I'm on Mary Jane Kelly so I'm near the end now so it won't be long I may well do a video review of this once I have finished it I'm going to go and get some lunch now so Jennifer because she's not happy because she was happy that I'd come home but I haven't really seen her so I'm going to go and play with her for a little bit have some lunch and then crack on with sorting out my eBay shop hopefully I'll be back a bit later so it's to let you know how it's going on I still got a ton of stuff to list. I need to crack on and get it done because it's not earning me money while it's sitting in my spare bedroom in bags. I'll be back soon. But like, I, one thing I say is that this vlog's very boring, so I don't do them weekly. I only do them every now and again. There is a boot sale tomorrow, so by the time you see this, hopefully we'll have been to the boot sale. Fingers crossed it's not rained off, and we may have a boot sale haul as well. So that's exciting. I will see you later, people. Oh. Morning, Jennifer. Sunday morning, and it's almost 8 o'clock. Yeah, we've come down to the Risker Tesco boot sale, and there's not a lot of people here yet. So, considering we're supposed to start at 8 o'clock, I mean, what, what's the time now? About a minute to? It's 8 o'clock. A minute to 8. So, it's not looking too good at the moment. That's uh. We thought we'd have a look, see if there's anything worth purchasing. Isn't that right, Paul? Isn't that right? Anything we can resell? Anything for the nutkin? Yeah. What do you think of it, Peanut? Yeah. Not sure, are you? Yeah. There's not a huge amount of people here. But it's not, it's tiny compared to somewhere like yeah. some stuff, boots, though, but they've got a lot of stuff. We'll have another look. I'm going to do a second ride now and I'm going to have a look. <laughs> second 
chicken boot of the day. And normally they have it all over on the green there, but uh, probably because it's been a bit wet. <laughs> so, it's not even actually 10 o'clock yet, it's supposed to start at 10. There's a lot of people here and there's a lot of people leaving already, so... Anyhow, we'll have a look around and see what we can find. What do you think uh, of that then? Rubbish! <laughs> That's what my dad says. At least they got an ice cream van, it's a bit cold though. There's a few more people here than last time. They're still not on the grass there, still a bit wet. I picked up some clothes, cheap. Not really cheap, but cheap as I like to, you know, as expensive as I like to go. Yeah. A couple of records. Yeah. And some books of peanut. So, I'll show you everything when we get CD, back. CD, a game for peanut. Oh, CD, a game for, a game for peanut? Yeah. Oh, but I haven't seen that. No. All right, well, we'll have a look when we get back. What's she doing? <laughs> have you got the burger bites? Have you? Yeah, Jennifer's nicked Mummy's burger bites and she's scoffing them. So we're back from the boot sale, done all the shopping. I've taken the puzzles upstairs. There was a Star Wars puzzle, a dinosaur's puzzle, and there was a Danger Mouse puzzle and quiz thing. So they sell for around 10 quid on eBay, which is fine. I bought some clothes, they were a pound each. I bought six items, standard bread and butter stuff. I bought her some book sets. Um, I'll show you. So we picked up this box. This is 20 classic children's stories. Little mini books. And there's a little drawer at the bottom with nothing in it. Oh, hello. <laughs> and, oops, they've just fallen out. We picked up the Flower Fairies Library. Paid £4 for the Flower Fairies. I know it's like selling for 20 quid on eBay, but it's not. It's not for sale. It's for peanut. Yeah. And we picked up this Paul McCartney record for a pound. This is a Russian album. And then there's uh, some clothes and the Jackson 5 Greatest Hits on album as well. Among other things, I'm going to call it a day. I think I'm shattered. Oh, we picked, I'll show you the CDs we picked up because, you know, you might be interested. Paul picked up uh, something called The Album. I have no idea. And then I picked up Phantom of the Opera. Um, Jimmy Nail tadpoles in a jar. I like Jimmy Nail. It's not the best one, but it's all right. And Paul got Led Zeppelin Celebration Day as well. Like I said, there were three puzzles upstairs. Oh, hang on, there's another one here. I thought there was another one. And this one is The Best Bands Ever. So yeah, talking to the guy that sold the vinyl, I said he got loads more at home and he's going to bring some down next time. That's because I said I was interested in having a look. So hopefully he'll bring it down and I'll be able to go through it. And... Yes, Jennifer. Yes, that's right. Pick up some uh, more records for my collection, even if I don't buy stuff to sell. So the problem with going to boot sales is I always find tons of stuff for me, which is fine. And for Jennifer, because she's a princess. There, you all done? Say goodbye. Wave. Wave. Jennifer saying goodbye. Wave. Good girl. And I will see you all next time. Bye.